saw nothing. You know what? I'm just gonna move to my office. <sighs> Much better. Anyways, guys, I cannot believe I'm saying this, but today marks this channel's three-year mark. Or anniversary year. You know, whatever you want to call it. Anyways, we are going to count down our top 10 favorite moments on my channel. Let's go. All right, so at number 10, we have my first ever video. All right, so it starts out like with me just, you know, introducing myself and oh my gosh. Yep, that would be me sticking my face in the camera. It was pretty unprofessionally done. It's because, well, it was um, made three years ago, exactly, today, June 30th, 2015. That's when this was made. Just hold it, push it down, leave it. Hello guys, this is Antonius. Uh, this is somebody that has a new channel. His name is Antonio Santiago, and that is me. Hello. For now, I'll just show you around the house. Who's my dog? Viva. Her name is Viva. There is Viva. And she was just a little puppy. Here's my kitchen. Here's. Oh my gosh, I remember the, this house. My living room. There's some random kind of video playing. So that's pretty much it for now. Bye. The reason this video is on the list, it's because you know it's gold. Like that's it's what started it all. I'm sure a lot of you have probably never seen it and. Yeah, I was 10 years old when it was made. Yeah, it was really tiny. All right, at number nine, we have my RC car commercial. Oh my gosh. This video is basically me, quote unquote, promoting this RC green Lamborghini. It, I used to think it was really stupid and cringy, but now that I'm rewatching it, it's pretty funny. Are you ready for speed? Awesomeness. <laughs> Forgive me for the you screen glitching. You can do glitching. that with the new green Lamborghini RC remote control car. This video is really old. Take it wherever you want to go. The new available RC Lamborghini. Available now at Toys R Us. Or should I say Toys Were Us. At number eight, we have my first ever Jurassic World 2 Fallen Kingdom toy review. This is actually a bit newer than all the previous entries on this list. Um, this was made in early April or late March, I believe. It's because I got this early. I was in Walmart one time and I saw a box that said, do not open until April 16th. Do not open until April 16th. And you know what? I'm a savage. I opened it and um, I saw all the battle damage dinosaurs that are by Mattel for Jurassic World 2. And I got the battle damage Herrerasaurus, which is what's in the video. And, um... I pretty much ruined it a couple of weeks ago. It's because I repainted it, but I wasn't really happy with the repaint. I plan on doing it again. And I literally tried to remove it with alcohol. Just, uh, that was a very stupid idea. And also, I'm sorry, but this video is um, too long for me to show you here. But you can check it out on my channel right now if you want to. All right, at number seven, we have Antonio's Kitchen, episode four, Puerto Rican Cheesy Rice. <gasps> Jeez, that's a mouthful. This is actually another Antonio's Kitchen episode, and it's pretty much me screwing up a Puerto Rican rice recipe by adding melted Velveeta cheese to it. You'll see later. I mean, it's it's because I'm part Puerto Rican, and um, we eat this rice all the time, and I wanted to get a little American twist to it. It actually tastes really good. And no joke, the end of the video is literally a time lapse of me eating the rice as the Godzilla 2014 theme blasts in the background. <laughs> Number six is the hilarious slingshot video. That ride was terrifying.
At the halfway point of number five is a hilarious video of me and my brother Nick eating the ghost pepper, as I like to call it, the great ghost chili. When really it should be called the Taco Bell Aftermath Chili, if you know what I mean. The video is just what you would expect. It's um, me and my brother trying it, see how long we can hold it in our mouths, and um, <laughs> I just happened to pause it right when he was making that face. We're just holding it in our mouths as long as we can. Classic ghost pepper challenge. Yeah, that's basically the video. Cheers. No, no, Cheers. No, no, no. For the next 30 seconds of the video, I look like I'm highly exaggerating myself, but I'm not. <sighs> Number four is a PSA I did on Toys R Us closing. The entire video is just dedicated to how sad it is that Toys R Us is closing, and I just and how I wish that I could just see my own kids shopping around in Toys R Us and how nostalgic it would be watching them and how I used to do it when I was little. And also, I apologize that I'm talking so quietly. It's because um, this section of this um, movie, well, video, is being filmed in my uncle's house, and it's... 1.35 in the morning, and I don't want to wake anybody up. But at the same time, I want to get my anniversary video out on schedule. Number four. So now we... Uh, I'm just going to say my dog's birthday. She has a really long name. This video was a lot of fun making it, and you guys absolutely loved it. It's on this list. It's, you can, it, it was just a lot of fun. Oh my gosh. My dog is in the kennel next to me. Like, she... She had to be put in the kennel, so she's right next to me, and um, so just trying to ignore that. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Viva Viva La Diva Las Vegas, Antonio Ramon Santiago. Happy birthday to you. Yes, that is her full name. Antonia Ramon Santiago. Yeah. Man. Poor dog. Oh, by the way, that's dog food, guys. Salmon. It stinks really bad. At number three, we... Oh, gosh. You know what? You can come out. Oh. Oh. Uh, oh. 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 Anyways, <clears throat> number three is the Antonio Zilla 2017 Christmas Special Teaser. I just like this one because I feel like it turned out really nicely. I think the editing was pretty good. The music synced with the video, and it was also a lot of fun making it. Yeah, uh, like it was. It still wasn't as fun as Chris the Christmas Special itself, but I just I don't know. I really like this teaser. It did not end up coming out the next day. Tried the next couple of weeks. It took me forever to make the, the actual video. Number two is the video where the slime that I was reviewing came to life. Hey guys, Antonio Zilla here. Welcome to a new video. And today we're going to be reviewing the slime that I found in my pantry that me and my niece made a little while ago, a couple of months ago, back in August, and it still works very well. It's the borax recipe. Okay, I think my, mo my mother's calling me, so I'll be right back. Oh my God. I'm sorry about that. <laughs> It was in a different pose. Why is my slime in a different pose? It can't move. It can only move by like spreading out very slowly. It's because it's a very thick liquid. 
Oh well, it's probably not that important then. Oh my gosh. Before we get to the top pick, let's list, oh my gosh, list off an honorable mention. My almost favorite video on Antonio Zilla is the video where I made slime or fluffy slime or, you know, whatever it's called, sticky stuff. I had a lot of fun making this video and what was funny was my mom was extremely sick then and she was constantly in the background like <laughs> like coughing really hard, it was pretty funny. And there was also, at the end of the video, there was a blooper show where it shows my failed slime attempt. As you can see, it's being flinged everywhere in the video with my hands and the worst part is I got walked in on I got walked in on with that mess and I don't know it was just really embarrassing <laughs> and now for the most beloved video on my entire YouTube channel is <laughs> just kidding it's not a video it's the entire line of Jurassic World 2 Fallen Kingdom toy reviews that I have done for the past four months, I think. These videos mean so much to me. It's because I always have so much fun making these, and the figures themselves are amazing. Mattel did everything perfectly. The paint, the sculpt, the movie accuracy, the, you know, the paint. Oh wait, I already said paint. And I definitely have a lot more reviews coming very, very soon. So yeah, you're gonna have a lot of Antonio Zilla in your face for a long time. So that was the top 10 best moments on my channel. Oh my gosh. Thank you guys so much for carrying me this far. It's been quite the ride. It's been three years since I made that first video. And um, once again, it's been quite the ride. I've had people that don't like me. I've had people that like me, and I have hardcore fans. I only have a select few hardcore fans. I mean, I have two, about 260 people who just like my channel, but just a select few of you actually really, really enjoy my stuff. As a matter of fact, I forgot to mention, my friend, um, my friend's classmate, uh, actually, I'll keep everybody anonymous, but um, my friend told me that his classmate's um, father just died and um, my, my friend told me that he watches my videos and he said that I'm funny and like that I'm the one, one thing that always makes him happy like since his family member died. And if you're watching this, I'm actually really glad, I'm really honored to be your enjoyment. And um, yeah, that's really cool. It's really cool, man. It's really good. Oh, oh, I almost fell off my chair again. Oops. And my friend also told, oh, Fly. My friend also told me that he actually um, didn't know that I actually used to go to that same exact school before he started going. And he actually went in my class and started digging in the closet and found my old stuff from my desk. And he actually took, I don't know, I think my pencil or something, you know, a souvenir. That's pretty cool. Why won't this turn off? Oh my gosh, not this again. Anyways, I hope you enjoyed this special video, and I will see you guys later.